my name is Kyle. Justin. Daniel. Josh. And today you're going to be watching an instructional video on defensive tactic of hitting the relay and cut off man and then baseball. Hi, didn't see you there. My name is Dan Keller. The table will be starting with the introductory activity in which there will be three men spread 15 to 20 yards apart. The middle man will be working on the tactic of relaying which he'll catch the ball high to, his, high to his head, turn, and throw it to his partner. After about 15 to 20 catches, the partners will switch roles, and then we will come. Here's a demonstration to show you how the activity is done. <clears throat> All right, on today's skills, we're going to be focusing on the throw. is going to be focusing on throwing the ball high to the glove side, and the relay man is going to be focusing on a quick transfer to a pivot. Next activity is called wagon wheel. It works on the catchers catching the ball, pivoting, and getting the ball out of their hands fast to simulate the relay. How it works is we're in a triangle formation. You can see here's one spot with the home plate. The next is the trash can there, and the third spot is the trash can there. There's going to be four players and three bases, and the way it works is two will start on home plate, one will fill that spot, and the other will fill that spot. I'll catch the ball, or I'll start with the ball. I'll throw it to this player. I immediately have to run and fill his spot. This player catches the ball and has already thrown it to the player at the other base, and then he runs and fills his spot, and then the cycle just continues. The next activity is called target relay. How the activity works is there is a one student, a catcher, down by the targets, which are these two trash cans by home plate. There's one cutoff man in the middle and one player in the outfield. The student at home plate throws a pop fly out to the outfield. The outfielder catches the ball and then throws it into the cutoff man who has to make a quick catch and turn to throw and try to hit the targets, which are the trash cans at home plate. Each time you hit the trash can, it's worth one point. If the player in the outfielder overthrows the cutoff man or misses the cutoff man, it's a negative point. There generally will be two teams competing against each other, and you'll just tally your scores up at the end. Cut! working on hitting a cutoff man with uh, different situational plays and uh, how this is going to work is we're going to have one outfielder, a shortstop, third baseman and a catcher so we're working on cutoffs on the left side of the field. Uh, the person at home plate is going to hit the ball out into the outfield and depending on uh, what he says, either cut three or four, is the shortstop either is going to make the cutoff throw to third base or the third baseman is going to cut the ball off and throw the ball home. Cut three! Get out there, DK. Left, left, left. Ready? Cut four! Right, right, you're good there, Josh. Get out a little more. Four, four. Cut three! I'm hitting bomb. 
bombs. So she was being instructional video on how to hit bombs. All right, ready? Oh! <laughs>